Oh, good How you doing there? <laughs> that was a f***ing complete failure. fog has been broken. The fog has been broken. Mm. What are we drinking today? Today we've got Fog Breaker IPA from Anchor Brewing. Super stoked about this. You've been to the uh, brewery? One of the best brewery tours I've ever been on. It was beautiful. San Francisco's great. That's awesome. 6.8% gets you drunker. Oh boy, that's a heavy one. Yeah. Anchor Brewing actually bought the rights to this bottle shape so no one else can do it. But we're gonna cover up the labels. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, sorry, Anchor Brewing. We gave you your love. Now we got to give a little love to ourselves. Yeah, we got these new Midnight Black, what I've been calling them, koozies. Bro, these are fire. They're so good. This is my favorite of the three we've made. Yeah, I really dig these. And today we're eating some more Screaming Sicilian, but not pizza. Yeah, dude, this is my first foray into the non-pizza Screaming Sicilian uh, type. It's a little bit of a, oh, there you go. There's a little shine on that, but they got stramboli. We got the meatball and pepperoni version. You know, it's got that mozzarella, the ricotta, parmesan, romano, four different types of cheeses. My very first time ever having a stromboli, I bet a lot of people are like this, Sbarro's in the mall. Oh, I, yeah, totally, totally. But I always like to come to New York a little bit early, and I'm gonna go get me a New York slice. I am somebody, and we still haven't done it on the show, is it still in business? I defend Sbarro's. I think it's, it's obviously bad, but it's like good bad. It's good bad? Yeah. Can you do me a favor and say mozzarella again? No. <laughs> <laughs> Ricotta, mozzarella, mozzarella. <laughs> Very excited, we air fried these about, we pretty much teeter between like 320 and 350 in the air fryer, turned them a couple times, but they're thick boys. They were in there for like tw probably 15 minutes. Yeah, to it took a little work. Yeah, so we cut them out open a little bit towards the end too, so it crisps up the inside pepperonis. I'm excited. Very excited. <laughs> What the hell was that, Corey? Ooh. Cultural episode. <laughs> All right, Mambo Italiano screaming Sicilian strombolis. Cheers. Cheers. Oh boy, this is pretty good. That's delightful. Something you buy in a frozen food section? <laughs> I know. Thick layer of cheese on the bottom there. Instant grease, mm -hmm. instant salt. Mm -hmm. I'm an instant fan. Oh yeah. It's like the meat's got a little cheese bed to sleep on in there. Mm -hmm. I respect that. That's good meatballs. <laughs> That's a good meatball. Mm. That's a good meatball. That's a good meatball. <laughs> Mmm. I like this. I'm a big fan. My question for you, I'm mm -hmm. a little nervous. Is it too bready on the Corey Wagner bready scale? Almost everything's too bready. Right. This is not. That makes me happy. I think because there's so much cheese mm -hmm. and the bread's so crispy and flaky. I don't know why it's not bothering me, but because usually bread really pisses me off. <laughs> it really gets under my skin. I'm a pissed off dude when I get too much bread, but this isn't bad. You put flour, sugar, yeast, and a bunch of other stuff to make bread, and you put too much of it, of course it's get it out of here. Mm-hmm. And you know what helps? This is so good. The seasoned bread. The fact that the top is covered in maybe basil or oregano or something, I don't know. But yeah. Um, it's like, you know, it's not like it's just completely full, but it's a good balance. Mm. Like it's a good balance of ingredients and then just dough. Mm -hmm. Like these full ass pepperonis. That's a big boy. Whoa. That was just inside. Show that how huge that, that's one of their pepperonis. Look at this cheese hanging off of it. Look at the steam. Dude, this is really good. They've been out of the air fryer for like, what, 12 minutes? minutes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look at this thing, it looks like a science experiment. I'm a fan. Put me in a lab coat, Bill. I was a little worried when you only get one of them. I know. But this is massive. It's huge. I would definitely get this. Oh my God, this is such a tasty snack. I can't believe how much I like this. I can. You like good things. And this is good. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm. I'm... Dude, I just heard a series of beeps. I think I'm losing it. Bro. Cheese pull. Cheese pull on a frozen food item. Great. Right? Sicilian does it again. Ooh, this might be my favorite item that they've made. Because you love the meat lovers, the mother of meats. It. The mother mm -hmm. of meats, this dude was losing it about mm -hmm. it. Mother of meat, cheers. Cheers. This might be my favorite screaming Sicilian. Yeah, this one's up there for me. Actually, I'm just gonna say it. This is my favorite screaming Sicilian. Wow, dude, I'm 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 happy today. Screaming Sicilian, 
We got Anchor Brewing. It's a solid Friday. I'm about to take a bite out of the back of this because, oh, you got the same thing. Meat fold hanging out. Look at how crisp up those packs got. Yeah. Right, I'll go on the back with you too. Let's go to the back end. Oh my God, it's so good, dude. Look at like the meatballs in there. <laughs> oh my God. Wow, I love the grease. I know that sounds like a negative thing, but if you're buying this, is it? Oh my God, dude. For my last few bites for this episode, it's gonna get some Sixer sauce. Got to. Screaming Sicilian, you know you want some Sixer sauce on a future item. Let's make it happen. Oh baby, holds it so well, two little pockets. Oh, that's gonna be so good. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Oh my God, that's the way to go. Dude, this is a top-notch frozen food item. I mean, how did they do this? This might be my favorite frozen food item. I'm so happy to hear that. Dude, this is so good. As an alcoholic, I'm not even drinking my beer. <laughs> in front of me. You, you know, know the first step is admitting it, <laughs> that you love this item, not that you've been a booze hound since 18. Mm, 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 mm. So when you want pizza, very few things will like satiate that other than pizza. Correct. I think this would do it. I agree. Before we go ahead and rate, the Stromboli from Screaming Sicilian. Keep in mind, they have a bunch of different flavors. We I'm got freaking out right now. That's so good. Let's do a shout out. Podcast, podcast shout, shout out, podcast, podcast shout out, podcast, podcast shout out. Dude, we got a podcast. We sure do. Every single Monday, a new episode goes live. Sorry. Dude, I'm losing it. I keep hearing. During quarantine, we've shifted the podcast to start having some guests on, talking with them, hearing their stories, jibber jabbering on. New episode every Monday on the Unemployables podcast, Website, YouTube channel, you know all the audio streams. It's linked below. Go check it out. We really appreciate it. Tell you what, I love a good jibber jabber. I love jibber jabbering. Remember jib jab? Jib jab. I love those videos. I used to, my dad and I would always send each other jib jabs. I'm a great crusader. You're a Herman Monster. This land will surely vote for me. As if there's any sort of guess that needs to be done right now, place your wagers, because this is a straight up, we take your money and you barely get any left. Eric McCluskey, quarantine, drum roll please. Looking good in that bubble, dude. That a boy. Thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not you liked, you enjoyed, you might overall, outside of the show, get again, the Mambo Italiano, screaming Sicilian Stromboli. Oh! Oh! oh. Stand up, stand up. Kind of looks like I'm doing some weird Yeah, stuff. it looks like this is a sexual thing that we do on off-screen time. <laughs> Guys, I want to get sexual off-screen with this thing. That was perfect. Uh, I think they were like five bucks, which is a great price for that. I mean, I think. It's like high-end. A very filling item. Mm -hmm. I'm yeah. full. I'm yeah. full. Dude, this honestly might be my favorite all-time frozen food item. Dude, is this a Stromboli channel now? This is a Stromboli channel. Only Stromboli. Hey, buckle up. Boys and girls, next week we're doing all Stromboli. That's not gonna happen. What, dude? What a weird thing of like, Patrick had to write a press release. It was like, yeah, kind Stromboli, of a weird thing, but the yeah. boys are becoming a Stromboli channel. We run out after nine videos. We're like, well, we're out of Stromboli. There's only nine we could find. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean that's an just get it right. A hundred percent. This is a grab in my opinion. Mm -hmm. It's so amazing. Yeah. Get that, and then enjoy your weekend. Have the rest of your beer. Get the koozies if you want to support the show. But seriously, anchor. You make good stuff. Yeah, sorry uh, we didn't talk about it as much as you sh we should have. This is a delicious beer. Anchor makes good stuff. Screaming Sicilian just makes better food. Yeah. That might not be true because I've never ate enough Stromboli yeah. that um, I bl blacked out and threw up in my printer. <laughs> <laughs> I've done that with beer before, so I don't know. You tell me what's more fun. Well, I'll see you guys Monday for a brand new video. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Five new videos every single week, just like we do. Share! I'll have a drink. That's what he's saying. We got the quote right there. Buy these and you can see it. Alcohol helps me forget. Also buy it because I think I might need a new printer now. <laughs> yeah. Dude, get this guy a printer. <laughs>